What up, guys? What up, YouTube? Just pulled up here in my daily. Just got uh, the new distributor harness. About to put it on and uh, finish up everything else and hopefully start this thing up today. Just put on these two little harnesses for the distributor. I'm waiting on a uh, camshaft and cam gear, but I'm just gonna go ahead and time it with the, the stock cam gear and stock camshaft. Just get it started right now. So I can hear this baby run, it's been a while. All right, so I've jacked it up so far. Next thing I'm gonna do is pull off this here uh, harmonic balancer and loosen that tension air right down there. I'm doing this the kind of cheating way. Um, didn't take off the harmonic balancer. I uh, just took out the spark plug out of here. Put this uh, little piece of aluminum down in there. And I got it at the top down center. See, I'm moving the back and forth and the top. So we're good on that. So now what I'm gonna do, uh, I got this all the way top dead center too it says up right there and there's two lines another line down there that's cool all I'm gonna do now is throw on the belt now I just pulled the valve cover off because uh, when I put the head studs in I didn't tighten them all the way tight I just tightened them snug in order so now I'm gonna go back get a 12 millimeter half inch uh, drive and get my torque wrench and start doing them in order all the way in, um, from the middle out yep it said to torque spec them on line to 22 all the way around first so i did that and then it said to spec them to uh 53 right after 20 but what i did is i went to 40 next on all of them and then after that i went to 60 on all of them so a little bit over tight but you know gotta make sure don't blow another head gasket so far we timed it got the distributor plug on and got the head studs tight next I'm gonna get my oil drain line on right down there to the bottom of the, to the bottom of the turbo and I think there's something else that I'm forgetting. I'll let you know if I remember it, but we're almost ready to start her up. Check it out. Just got the oil drain line on. Look at that. Pretty nice. So now I'm going to stick some oil in it. Go over everything. Put a battery in it. I'm also going to tighten that motor mount. And that one, that bolt right there. And then uh, see if she starts up. And I'll get a first start of video. I'll end up putting the camera like right over here. So you guys can see if it does start. I don't know. I don't think it is. I don't know. We're going to find out together right now. All right, I just put the battery on. So, cross your fingers, guys. I hope she starts. Nah, I don't want to even turn it over. It's running, guys! It's running!
fucking did it, guys. Fucking did it. Fucking runs, dude. Fucking runs the drillers. About to go for a fucking cruise without no fucking radiator. I don't care. Fuck this. Yeah. I need to tighten that clutch cable up some more and start to grind. It grinded a little going into first gear. But she fucking runs and drives, guys. All the little shit to finish from here on, and she's gonna be golden. Waiting for my buddy Josh to get here and bring me a mini intercooler to put in here. I'll start doing all that. I also gotta cut out the bottom down here for the radiator to fit down in. vacuum lines I ran it off my brake booster to uh, that thing it comes down goes to my waste gate and the other one comes across goes to my blow-off valve got the radiator in there got my homemade overflow in there coming along coming along next I got to get the intercooler in and uh, the rest of the intercooler piping on Letting it warm up a little bit. Got the radiator all in there. No brackets on it. A lot of condensation. Let me know what you guys think. Like, subscribe.